Let's begin today's class in a seated posture. Palms facing up for receiving. Start by closing the eyes. Just tuning into your natural breath. Imagine yourself sitting on a warm, sandy beach. The sand is soft and white. It cushions you perfectly. The sound of the ocean waves crashing gently on the shore fills your ears with a rhythmic, soothing sound. With every inhale, breathe in the fresh, salty air. With every exhale, imagine letting go of any worries or stress. Let's take a cleansing breath together. Inhale, fill the belly, the ribs, chest. Audible exhale out of the mouth. Again, inhale, fill up the belly, the ribs, the chest. Audible exhale out the mouth. This time, sealing the lips. Inhale, fill up the belly, the ribs, the chest. Exhale out the mouth. Gently opening up the eyes and making your way into tabletop position. Hands underneath shoulders, knees underneath hips. Now bring the knees out wide towards the edges of your mat. Sink the hips down towards your heels, coming into child's pose, reaching the arms forward. Spending a couple more moments in your child's pose, feeling the warmth and hearing the sounds of the waves. Inhale, reaches you back up, walking your hands back towards your knees, bringing the knees together and lifting yourself up and down onto your seat. And then making our way all the way onto our back, planting the feet, hugging the knees into the chest. You can rock side to side, bringing forehead to meet the knees, giving yourself a nice big hug. Pausing here for a couple breaths. And then releasing the legs out and over to the right. Arms out to a T, supine twist. Your gaze can be neutral or over the left shoulder.
Inhale as you bring your knees back through center. Exhale, supine twist over to the left. Arms out to a T, gaze is over the right shoulder. yourself a couple more breaths as we inhale bringing the knees back through center giving yourself a nice big hug and squeeze and then grabbing the back of your thighs start to roll forward and back on your mat really rounding the spine as we come forward and back Holding in your boat pose when you come up. This is a balancing posture. On your last rock up, hold here in your boat pose. Arms reach out towards your feet. You can lengthen through the legs or you can keep them bent. Really lengthening through the spine, engaging the core. Exhale, plant the hands, coming back into tabletop position. Hands underneath shoulders, knees underneath hips. Let's do a couple of cat cows. Inhale, lower the belly, lift the gaze. Exhale, round the spine, tuck the chin, cat. Inhale, lower the belly, lift the gaze. Exhale, round the spine, tuck the chin. Inhale to cow. Exhale, cat. Inhale, cow. Exhale, cat. Hold in your cat. Circle it around. Do whatever movement that you need to begin your practice. Circle out the hips. You can come into upward facing dog. But linking your breath to your movement. Coming back to tabletop position. Tuck the toes and lift the knees off the mat just a couple inches. Really engage the tummy to the spine. Hold here. Exhale, lift the hips up and back, downward facing dog. Pedal out your dog here, bending into one knee and then the other. Shaking the head yes, nodding at no. Really pressing through those hands. Inhale, come onto the tippy toes. Exhale, release the heels down. Stay here for a couple breaths. Inhale, gaze up at your hands. Exhale, gaze back down at your feet. And start to walk your hands towards your feet to the back of your mat. Hang heavy here, sway side to side. Making sure that your head is dropped. Grab for opposite elbows with opposite wrists. Shake the head yes, nod it no. Release the hands. 
As you inhale, halfway lift, hands on shins, gaze past your mat. Exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway lift, this time hands on your thighs, really round the shoulders down and back. Exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway lift, hands on shins. Exhale, fold. Inhale with one vertebrae at a time, making your head the last to come up. Come all the way to stand. Palms to your side, and then palms at heart center. And let's begin. Let's take a couple breaths together. Inhale, fill the belly, the ribs, the chest. Palms at heart center. Inhale, circle sweep. Gaze up at your fingers. Exhale, fold with a straight spine. Inhale, halfway lift, hands on shins. Exhale, fold, walk your hands back to the top of the mat, coming into a plank, dropping the knees, lowering yourself into your chaturanga, chin to mat, placing the palms right next to your rib cage. Inhale to cobra, exhale, chin to mat. Inhale to cobra. Exhale, chin to mat. Inhale to cobra. Exhale, chin to mat. Inhale to cobra, lifting through the arms, lifting the knees off the mat into upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Three breaths in your down dog. Inhale the front of the heart, exhale the back of the heart. Inhale, gaze about your fingers, exhale, gaze back down at your feet and walk your hands to meet your feet. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, root to rise. Arms reach up. Exhale, hands through heart center. Inhale, circle sweep. Exhale, fold. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, fold. Walk your hands out to plank. And float out. Chaturanga to upward facing. Exhale, downward facing dog. Three breaths in your down dog. When you're ready, gaze up at your hands, gaze back down at your feet, and walk your hands to meet your feet. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, root to rise, arms reach up. Gaze up at your fingers, exhale, Samas Titi. Inhale to reach. Exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Walk the hands out to your plank. Hold in your plank. And then chaturanga to upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. 
three breaths in your down dog. Inhale the front of the heart. Exhale the back of the heart. Inhale, gaze up at your hands. Exhale, gaze back down at your feet. Walk your hands to meet your feet. Forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, root to rise, arms reach up, gaze up. Exhale, hands through heart center, Psalms TT. Inhale, reach. Exhale, fold. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, walk your hands out to the front of the mat, coming into plank, chaturanga to upward facing. Exhale, downward facing dog. Come down to the knees. Bringing the knees out wide, sinking the hips down. Reaching the hands out in front of you. Coming into child's pose. Take rest. Give yourself three more deep breaths. Begin by walking your hands back towards your knees and then coming into a tabletop position. Tuck the toes, lift the hips up and back, downward facing dog, and then step to the top of your mat, Samas TT. Inhale to chair pose, arms reach, sink back into your seat. Exhale, tuck the tail. Pulling all our weight into our heels, so maybe our toes can come off the mat. Inhale to lengthen. Exhale, sink a little bit deeper. Inhale, coming onto the tippy toes, releasing the arms back behind you, coming into drinking bird. Exhale, release the heels, arms reach. Exhale, Samas TT. Inhale, step the right foot back. Pivot both toes, arms out to a T. Now we're facing the long edge of our mat. Pivot the right toes to the back of the mat. Bend into the right knee. Gaze is over the right shoulder, coming into our warrior two. Strong warrior two. Gaze is past the right fingertips. Making sure our right knee is not over our right ankle. Exhale, lengthening through the right leg. Pivot the right toes. Now pivot the left toes, bending into the left knee, warrior two to the front of the mat. You're here for five breaths. Gaze is past the left fingertips. 
making sure our knee is not over our ankle. Sink a little bit deeper. Making sure our arms are parallel to the mat. Lengthen through the left leg. Pivot the left toes, pivot the right toes back towards the back of the mat, bend into the right knee, warrior two. Now, shifting onto the ball of the left foot, inhale to high crescent lunge. Arms are lifted, everything is pulling towards our midline. Two more breaths. Lengthen through the right leg, arms out to a T. Pivot the right toes, pivot the left toes towards the front of the mat. Bend into the left knee, come onto the ball of the right foot, high crescent lunge. Arms are lifted, left knee is bent. You're here for three more breaths. Exhale, lengthen through the left leg, arms out to a T. And then Samas Titihi, top of mat. Inhale, chair pose, arms reach. Sink back into your seat. Bring the arms behind you. Inhale, up to the drinking bird. Exhale, release the heels. Inhale to chair. Exhale, Samas Titihi. Inhale, step the right foot back, arms out to a T, pivot the right toes, bend into the right knee, warrior two. Inhale to high crescent lunge, arms reach up, stay on the ball of the back foot. Exhale, palms through heart center, prayer twist over to the right hooking the left arm onto the right thigh. Pressing firmly with both palms, trying to move our palms into our chest. You're here for three more breaths. You got this. Drop the hands, step the right foot to meet the left and flow it out, chaturanga to upward facing. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, gaze up at your hands, exhale, step or hop to meet them. Forward fold. Inhale, chair pose, arms reach. Exhale, swing the arms behind you. Inhale, coming onto the tippy toes, drinking bird. Exhale, chair pose. Inhale, breath here. Exhale, Psalms TT. Now this time, step the left foot back, arms out to a T. Bend into the left knee, warrior two. Come onto the ball of the right foot, high crescent lunge. Exhale, palms through heart center, prayer twist to the left. 
hooking the right elbow onto the left thigh, pressing firmly with both hands. Two more breaths. Exhale, plant the hands, step the left foot to meet the right and flow it out. Chaturanga to upward facing. Exhale, downward facing dog. Bending the knees, sinking yourself into your child's pose. Taking rest. Coming into a brief tabletop position, tucking the toes, lifting the hips up and back, downward facing dog. Gaze up at your hands, exhale, step or hop. Inhale, Samas Titi. Inhale, arms reach, gaze up, exhale, fold. Begin in a low squat with your feet about hip width apart. Place your hands flat on the mat in front of you, shoulder width apart. Spread your fingers wide and press through the entire palm and knuckles. Now from the squat, come up slightly so you can place your knees as high into your armpits as possible. Lean forward slowly, transferring your weight from your feet to your hands. Look forward, not down. Now start by lifting one foot off the ground and then the other. When you feel stable enough, keep your big toes touching as you can find your balance. Engage your core. This will help make it easier to hold your legs up. Now to exit, gently lower your feet back to the ground. Step the feet back and flow it out. Chaturanga to upward facing. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, lift the right leg up, three-legged dog. Exhale, bringing the right knee to the right wrist, right foot to left wrist, coming into your pigeon pose, tenting the fingertips. Inhale, puff up the chest. Exhale, fold. If your forehead does not meet the ground, you can bump up your fists so that your forehead can greet your knuckles. Taking three more deep breaths. Walking your hands back up towards your shin. Inhale to lengthen. Planting the hands, stepping the right foot to meet the left. Downward facing dog, inhale. Left leg lifts. Bending at the knee, bringing the left leg through to pigeon. Shifting the right leg back. Planting the hands, stepping the right foot to meet the left. 
downward facing dog inhale left leg lifts bending at the knee bringing the left leg through to pigeon shifting the right leg back inhale tent the fingertips open up the heart exhale folding over your shin dropping the head dropping the neck You're here for three more breaths. When you're ready, walking the hands back towards your shin, planting the hands firmly as you bring the left leg to meet the right downward facing dog. Bending at the knees, dropping the knees, coming into tabletop, and then making your way onto your back. Hug the knees into your chest, giving yourself a nice big hug and squeeze forehead to meet the knees. Grab a hold of the outer edges of your feet, making your way into happy baby. Tucking the knees into the armpits. You can rock side to side. You can release one leg out long and then the other. And then releasing your legs out long. Coming into your final resting posture. Shavasana. Take rest. Gently bringing awareness back into the body. Start by wiggling the fingers, wiggling the toes. Reaching the arms up and over your head for a nice big stretch. And then rolling on to whatever side is calling you into fetal position. Hands are tucked underneath your head. Pausing here. Then making your way up through to seated. Palms are in your lap. Facing up for receiving. It was my honor to guide you throughout your practice today. From the light in me to the light in each and every one of you, I bow with deep gratitude. Namaste.